speakers. So uh, I am I am the CEO and designer of ESD Acoustic. We are from Hangzhou, China. We are China's first and so far the only high-end brand. This system you see here is our flagship system named Dragon. As you can see, it's a it's got big horns and you have seven horn units on each side and also three comb subwoofers in the back of the big horn. The subwoofers are in charge of 50 Hz and lower. The big horn is in charge of 50 to 100 Hz. This one is from 100 to 500, 500 to 2000. The tweeters are from 2000 to 8000 and the super tweeters are from 8000 to 52,000 Hz. Uh, these are symmetrical so that the sound stage will be the same as the mid-range. All, all, all the horns are made of carbon fiber. We are the world's first company to make carbon fiber horns because carbon fiber is resonance free and uh, carbon fiber horns does not produce the so-called horn sound that uh, audiophiles always refer to uh, due to resonance of horn while playing music. Uh, there are 25 electronics here. This is a CD. It's a three machine set. This is a separate power supply. This is a controller and this is a trans, uh, transport. So this line, the machines are all separate power su supply for this line. This is a decoder. This is a preamplifier. And then it goes to two five ways analog active crossovers. So these crossovers feed the signal to five amplifiers on each side. Each amplifier drives one way of horn. The, the amplifiers are all class A 10 watts. They are single-ended solid state, so uh, unlike traditional solid state, they are more tube sounding, but with very low background noises. Like right now I'm pausing the system, but you will not hear the background noises that usually uh, the systems will make. Uh, they, they're, also, they're also special in MOSFET. Uh, they are carbon silicon MOSFET tubes that instead of pure silicon. So it can endure high, higher temperature, more sensitivity, and uh, more accuracy. All the electronics here are powered by switch mode power supplies, specially designed for hi-fi instead of uh, traditional transformers. So we cooperated with China's um, number one switch mode power supply company, Inventronics, to develop it. These four are field coil power supply because all our units are field coil instead of permanent magnet. Field coil is also known as electromagnet. Well, we know that most speakers are using permanent magnet. Though called permanent, they last for about 20 to 30 years. But for electromagnet, you can use it up to 200, 300 years uh, once you have electricity. So uh, there's another advantage of electromagnet is that it goes to a very high dynamic density. All the drivers you see here can get to 2.4 tesla of magnetic density in the slits. Uh, in comparison, most normal speakers are like 1.2 tesla around that. So these speakers are like super sports car com compared to normal ones. So it stops faster and accelerates faster. Uh, they have better control and better transient response. So all the uh, mid-range tweeter and super tweeter use beryllium diaphragms. They are foiled instead of vaporized, uh, coming from trick stamps. The mid-bass, bass, and the subwoofer use titanium sandwich diaphragms. First layer is titanium, second layer is honeycomb aluminum, third layer is titanium, again. So uh, this structure provide very good damping of the, the diaphragm. Uh, it, does not, it does not have the ring effect that one single layer of metal usually occur. And uh, the, this structure is ultra hard and stiff. We have a sample over there. Uh, you can you can see that I can put my whole weight on it without deforming it. So uh, it's got very low total harmonic distortion. The subwoofer down there 
provide only 0.5% harmonic distortion at 20 Hz. The horns are better. Uh, the mid-range here only provides 0.1% harmonic distortion at 1000 Hz. Um, they are also very efficient. Uh, the mid-range is uh, 120 decibel at 111 one meter. So I believe right now it's the uh, most, most efficient unit so far. And the biggest horn also has 110 decibel. So all the horn units are very efficient. That's why we only need 10 watts, 10 watts in each amplifier to drive them to the loudest that you just, just heard. So that that is our um, special uh, that, is, that is our flagship system, Dragon. This is a special version, again, it's a Chinese lacquer. Chinese lacquer was an uh, Asian art of royal court. We have an introduction over here. We have a uh, gold lining underneath the lacquer and a hundred layers of lacquer uh, above. We have six artists who worked for 15 months of it. So uh, it costs 3.6 million euros, the whole set. But for standard setup, it's 1.08 million euros. Aside from Dragon System, we also have Phoenix, Crane, Panda, Aviator. Uh, that those you can look around uh, in this in this hall and some information here. We also have our headphone and the headphone amplifier that you can experience over there. If you have more questions you can ask me you can also visit our website esdacoustic.com thank you very much thank you.
What is the price of each one? Is this one? This um, the a set is a uh, four. Oh, four. 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 Yeah. four. And two thousand one hundred. Two thousand one hundred. Four hundred equal to eight. Okay. Two two thousand. Two point four k. Ah, okay. Equal to eight. Yeah, yeah. So without eight, two thousand. Okay. So within yeah. eight, two thousand four hundred. Four. Four. Zero four. So. Yeah. Nice. And this one the price is. Uh, that was also one set for three thousand. Three thousand. Okay. I think it's it's working good. It's working well. It's a proof sound. I I know it. But for that actually, you need to have this spine. Yeah, 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 yeah. But that is extra. Yeah. Keystone, yeah? The spark fabric Keystone, yeah? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Nice, nice. Thank you. And you make cables also, yeah? No, 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 no. no? Yeah, only for... Ah, only... Yeah. yeah. This is this sound wings? Yeah. So, imagine that you hear the vibration it coming and yeah. that stay and this it goes out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Reduce vibration to, to heat or the worm. Yeah, exactly. Okay. That these are from um, from here. This the vibration come, and then I hear this uh, going through, and then it's going out. And then it's then from the okay. system. How much is? This one? Um, this one. Uh, you got a matter way, just a uh, handbag middle? Hanae? You got it? Yeah. Ah. This is, is still a prototype, so um, no, we don't have a price. Okay, here. and this one? This is around about 1000 yeah. euro. 1000 euro. Yeah. yeah. For yeah. four. Four. Mm -hmm. Set four. Okay. You can manage it now. <laughs> that is, uh, these are for turntable here. Yeah.
it was 2012. And after that we released Air Force 2, Air Force 3, Air Force 1 Premium turntable, which is over there, and Air Force 2 Premium, and Air Force 3 Premium, that's the black and gold turntable there. And Air Force 5, Air Force 5 Premium turntable. In 2019, um, at, at the Munich show here, we introduced the, the biggest Air Force Zero turntable. The, the weight is 350 kilograms. And the platter has, a five, has five layers. And the total height of, uh, weight of the platters is 130 kilograms. And in all of our turntables, the platters are floating on air, even the Air Force Zero 130 kilogram uh, platters are floating on the air suspension system. And this year, we, um, for the first time, we are demonstrating the first toner from Texas, Texas Air Force 10 toner, which is also floating on air.
Yes. You get it with the Okie Dokie. Okay. Can I see? Mm -hmm.